up, what up, I see Miss Ward, and welcome back, guys. It's your boy Sean. And your girl. Yes, yes, yes. Well. Hey, yeah. How are you guys doing today? We hope you guys are absolutely amazing. Yes, guys, hey, you're having a rough day all day. Let's turn it around, all right? With some good energy and some good content. All right, my love. Great content. Let's right? go, baby. So, my lovely wife, who we have today? Okay, today we'll be reacting to why is this history of slavery hidden in schools? Wow. Oh, this I topic. I asked myself that question this morning. Like, why wasn't it? Why didn't we school? learn about slavery? Hmm. We learned, like, surface type of things about slavery, like... Um, the saddle, the European settlers. Yeah, they went to Africa, the continent of Africa, and we were brought over here yeah. on boats, and people jumped over. People didn't eat on those boats and stuff like that. But we didn't learn the meat and potatoes. I remember them about the slave trade. Putting on the Roots movie, let them let us watch it, and you know we're not really paying attention because we're kids and we're you know not really paying attention. You know and what? They we really just learned that Roots is not based on fact. That's what I'm saying. It's based on fiction. So let's get into this video. Let's go get into love. it, right? So guys, before we get into it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and also turn on your post notification bell so you guys be notified. We appreciate the love and support, guys. All right? Let's go. Here we go. Good energy, good content. Let's go. Back in school. Let's go. We are in <laughs> school, guys. Yes. Educate me. Here we go. Tom Reparations. We began by talking about disparate impact, the idea that discrimination is so deeply embedded in the American experience that it can take place even in the absence of an intention to discriminate. Mm -hmm. So this argument, which is that there's something, some basic flaw or sin that's still with us, comes up in the case for reparations. Mm -hmm. Longish quotation, but it's, it sets something up but from Ta Nahisi Coates in an article in The Atlantic entitled The Case for Reparations. White supremacy is not merely the work, work of hot-headed demagogues, but a force so fundamental to America that it is difficult to imagine the country without it. And so we must imagine a new country. Reparations is the price we must pay to see ourselves squarely. Oh, the wealth okay. gap merely puts a number on something we feel but cannot say, that American prosperity was ill-gotten and selective in its distribution. What I'm talking about is more than recompense for past injustices. What I'm talking about is a national reckoning that would lead to spiritual renewal. Close okay. quote. And Tom Sowell makes nice. what of that? <laughs> uh, I, I, well, it, explain, it, it, it tells me that I mean, I've made the right decision not to read the Atlantic for, uh, for decades. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> wow. Slavery is a very big subject. I, I have in my home an entire bookcase of nothing things, books about slavery in various parts of the world and various times of history. And the sad fact is that slavery has been a universal institution for thousands of years, as far back as you can trace human history. Yeah, it's in the Bible. And what we're looking at is if slavery is something that happened to one race of people in one country, when in fact the, 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 the spread of it was around the world. In, in 1776, which is when Adam Smith published The Wealth of Nation, as mm -hmm. well as when the United States got started, he said that Western Europe is the only place in the world where there is no slavery. Uh, and even, in Western, even the Western Europeans had vast numbers of slaves in the Western in, Hemisphere, yes. but not in Western Europe itself. And so if you're going to have reparations for slavery, it's going to be the greatest transfer of wealth back and forth uh, and, 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 and cross-hauling, as they say in, in the railroads, because the, the number of, of whites, for example, who were enslaved in uh, North Africa by the Barbary pirates exceeded the number of Africans enslaved in the United States Ooh. and in the American colonies before that. Put wow. What did he just wow. say? Wow. The number of whites enslaved in West Africa. I got to take that back. Exceeded the number of slavery that's in yeah, the United States. Yeah, the United States slavery. Wow. This guy is so um, intelligent. 
he's impacted with so much knowledge. Ugh. Ignorance can't be bliss. Here it can't guys. be bliss. Just by him saying it. So if you're going to have reparations for slavery, it's going to be the greatest transfer of wealth back and forth. Uh, and between and and and, and cross hauling, as they say in, in the railroads, because the, the number of, of whites, for example, who were enslaved in uh, North Africa by the Barbary pirates exceeded oh, North Africa. the number of Africans North Africa. enslaved by the in the Barbar United States Barbary pirates. And in the okay. American colonies before that, put together. Put together. I know, but nobody is going to North Africa to ask for reparations because nobody is going to be fool enough to give it to them. Uh, here we have we have intellectuals. Who can, who can imagine a different history from the rest of the world, even though it's so similar to the rest of the world. Oh my gosh. This is, uh, everything we were taught was a lie. I am so saddened by this. I'm so distraught, I'm so hurt. Oh my gosh, because I've heard people talk about <laughs> reparations, like saying that we should get money Every black person in America deserves money for our ancestors being enslaved. And that's right. how we squared away. Right. You know, and I'm, you know, who, who wouldn't want a, a check right. for your ancestors being you enslaved? But the truth no is, there were more European slave, European slaves, European slaves than African. That means everyone gets checks, right? Meaning African descent slaves who came over to America. So that's going to be the biggest amount of money spread out throughout the world because there were slaves everywhere. Wow. Okay. Africans had European slaves, East Africans. Okay. Wow. So what do they do? Do the Europeans go over to East Africa saying, "Give me my check"? Right. Vice versa, right? Like what? Like what's going on here? But my problem is, you know, to be in school for twelve years and this to be not taught, it was hidden. This did not come up in our school systems. We were definitely failed. And now it 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 take us to. Now we are grown adults with, with with children to find out this information. I mean, it's truly through social sad media. Because slavery did not just happen. They made us to believe that slavery happened when Africans were taken from their land and sent over, well, brought over to Af to America to work in cotton fields, to work land, be beaten, hung on trees, and everything like that. They put that in our minds that we are the only ones who have gone through such a horrible tragedy. And, and it's not, not true. Because when you think about it, Pharaoh in the Bible, he was leading his people out of the wilderness. I Let my that. people yeah. go. That's, so that's the they were enslaved. They were wow. enslaved by the Egyptians. And I think, you know, they want to, you know, paint this false narrative so we can have this division, so we can have this hate, so we can look at white people like, oh, you guys did this to us. And, you know, that's just not the case. It's like when you get a, a real understanding of history, uh, that's based on facts. Facts. <sighs> wow. You start to really see things differently. This yes, is, this is hurtful for me. And um, it shall come to, to the light. To be lied to. It shall come to the light. You know, um, it just was not in the textbooks. It was. It was not on the chalkboards. It was not coming out of the teachers to to teach us this this Most importance, definitely. the importance of you know knowing your history. history, and not just it's American history because you hear. People say, oh, we were kings and queens when we were over there. That's not true. Our ancestors were slaves over there and we were sold. Yes. So it's like, and well, we weren't sold, but our ancestors our were. Our ancestors definitely had to go through that. So basically, 
Europeans didn't make us slaves. They didn't barge in. They didn't just. They didn't make us. Our, they over. didn't make our ancestors slaves. Africans did. Sold us. And now the white people got to get all this backlash, you know. And it's it's not fair. I mean, my, nobody opinion, wants to be a slave. It's not so fair. So I can understand people being upset. But before you misguide your anger, do your research. Learn a couple things before Definitely you go out into the world with hatred. And, and then you'll have a better understanding. With the with a with a crooked eye, you know, bad energy, the division that they want, that they need in the United States. Um, we had we, we we really have no room for it, you know. So um, as long as we stick together. They don't want that. They want us divided, and they want hate, and it's sad. Guys. It makes money, so we really need to put an end to this. You know. All right, tell guys, tell us what you think about this video. Are you guys like us? You know, was the so education deep. given to you guys untrue? Did you get half truths and teachers who didn't really give you the correct curriculum? Yes, and it's almost like teach you the correct curriculum. They told the teachers that, you know, we're not going to teach these Spoon kids. feed them these lies. Let's tell them something else. So that we them, can have let them watch Roots people who them, vote for us. Let them, let them just make up their own minds <laughs> about Roots. In about 10 they years, they'll be voting. So you got to give them the lies early on. So, all it's right, so guys. Sad. Let us know what you guys think about this video in the comment section. If you guys have any video about yes. this topic or any other topics, drop it, off. drop it off in the comment section. We need to be educated. And we'll pick it up. All right, all right guys. This is, this is blowing our minds. It's deep. All right. All hey, right. it's your boy, Show. And your girl. Love the pieces. Now. I love you more, babe. We, we love, love you, guys. you guys. Have an amazing day. More purpose. Your body. Peace.